What's up guys, this is the official Brit, and welcome to, welcome to, sorry, I can't talk right, welcome to what's gonna be my last squad builders on FIFA 14. Yes, I will not be doing any more until the game is released, FIFA 15 that is, I'll be doing some web app stuff, but this is the last team, this one I'll be spending the most time on, uh, I'll be doing two squads today, the next one will be, I'll be just showing it to you, I won't be building it or anything. And that will be that. Let me just get into summary. There we go. All right. So it's a standard. Um, it's a standard BPL team. This team, but that's not it. That, there's a focus to it. There is a point. There is a thing, and there's a reason why I'm not showing you the bench because it will be coming later. The team name is the Beasts. And honestly, the team is a pretty standard team up until the final two players. But anyway, we're going to start. Let's just set the league to a BPL, best league in my opinion, and we got a choice between Czech or Courtois, and we're going to go with Czech because he handles like a god. All right, now we move to the centre backs, and we and there are only a few people we can do for BPL centre backs. We got David Louise. David Louis, Louis, Louis. David Louise, the Afro pace abuser. In the middle, we're going to go with Company because he's just rock solid. I haven't used him properly before. But, I mean, hey, it's Company. He looks like an absolute tank. All right, let's go. I'm pumped. I'm pumped. All right, next into by Cub. I was like, maybe we could go with Cubble. But then I thought, let's go with Coyote. He will be just as helpful with that lovely 82 pace, 82 heading, and high 80 strength. Now we're going to go on to the central defensive mid, and we're going to go with the... No, no, we're going to go with another pace abuser, and it's Ramirez. Because Ramirez is a god. Left midfield, we're going to... I think it's a left wing, actually. We're going to go with the best left wing in the Premier League. Not Podolski, although I love his back across goal. We're going to go with Schürrler, who's an absolute beast at long shots. All right, now we're going to move on to this guy. I believe he's in central defensive midfield. No, central midfield, I mean. And we're going to use Dembele because he's got high high, which is all right. And I like him there because his left foot long shots, just like Schürrler. Well, Schürrler's a righty, but you know what I'm getting at. It's the long shots. It's the long shots that I'm um that I'm getting at here. All right, moving on to right midfield. I was thinking, well, we've got to try to five star skillers here, and I honestly prefer Nani, so we're going to use him. Cam, hey, we're using the best, one of the best cams in the game. He's currently residing at central midfield, and it is De Bruyne. And now, guys, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Because when you see this, you're gonna flip. We're gonna start with the strikers, and they're not one, but there are two! Beasts! No! Yes, we have Benteke in form. Benteke with the Hunter chemistry style. And we have in form Lukaku also with the Hunter chemistry style. Because their blackness is going to hunt you. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness, this is going to be a really fun team to use. But anyway, guys, the the strikers may be the good thing, but wait till you see the bench. There's a reason why this is called the beasts, because I've compiled a list of all the beasts in this game. You can see his name's just popped up when I hovered over the bench. It's Hesky, but that's not all. Because if you look at the bench, we have Hesky. Hesky die. <laughs> bitch, I'm Hesky. You don't want to mess with me. If you do, you're going to be my next. Ain't no rest of you. Oh my goodness, 32 pace, what a god, but 85 heading, we have Akin Fenwa, also with the hunter chemistry style, applies to him, because Akin Fenwa will also hunt you down, we have team of the season, Martins, because Martins is a beast, we have the legend himself, Antonio! Antonio! We have Icewine, the pace whore from FIFA 13. We have Ibarbo, that's right, the 300k Ibarbo that I, that I got. 300k, thank you, Nick Schleith. 
And of course, we have Kone, the black blonde man. And in the reserves, we have Inform 9 Golden, who I picked up because I thought I was going to make a Belgium team, but I didn't. Then we have Neuer, best keeper in the game, Royce, best left wing in the game, Abuma Yang, and Muriel. Sweaty strikers all round. Thank you very much for watching this squad builder. We have one more to do. This is just going to be so much fun. You don't even, you don't even know. You don't even know how fun this is going to be. And now moving on to the next one, which is the super sweat team, which I built. And oh my goodness, the sweat is ridiculous. Uh, the back four, uh, I'm trademarking that by the way, I have not seen it anywhere else and I believe I came up with it first, it's a classic back four, you can use it whenever, let's, so let's say the centre back only has one link to the midfield, that's what you need to use this, um, because you have the green link between the centre back and outside back and then the centre back and the outside back, that keeps them both um, available, to. Yeah, keeps them uh, happy, quote unquote. Uh, with the red links to the midfield, which means you can keep them uh, isolated without putting out any more BPL. Again, we're going to go with Czech as opposed to Courtois. We've got Armero, 90 pace. Cayute, 82 pace. Cayute, 82 pace. Cayute, 82 pace. Cayute, 82 pace. No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Kabul, 78 pace, and Walker, 92 pace. Very, very sweaty. And then, of course, we have Abumayang, Gundogan, Royce, and Ibarbo, Guarin, and Cuadrado. An absolute sweat-filled attacking lineup. When on the bench, we've got... Pogba, again he's a beast, Vidal, Company, Neuer, Sturridge, De Bruyne, and Draxler. Whew. Wow. Um, I feel like the energy's been taken out of me because of how beast all of these players are. But um, anyway, in fact, you know, I was only going to do two squad builders, but I will, I'll, I'll throw in, you know, just a tour of the rest of um, all the other teams I've made over the years. This is the oldest team. I haven't used this in a long, long time. This team got me from Division 6 all the way up to Division 3 or so. Uh, this is the first time I combined um, Abumiang and Benteke when I first thought I can use an, uh, a midfielder to combine these two sweaty strikers. And of course, this is where I first learned about Dembele's insane long shots. Yeah, this was a really nice team, not going to lie. This was, this was great. Then we move on to the team. I don't know if you remember this squad builder, but this has probably been the most successful team for me so far. I've actually upgraded it. Um, the last version of the team had uh, SEN here, and it had the um, the other version of Sydney Sam, which means which, me which meant past tense, which meant that um, Kevin Prince Boateng only had one green link, which means he couldn't deal with two red links, so I had to use SEN to get that Ghana in chemistry, but now Sydney Sam is at um, Schalke. So I can get those two green links, which means I can switch to my defensive midfield of choice, which is, of course, Ramirez, because the sweat is real when it comes to Ramirez. So that is the team. Uh, I believe the next one is Debent Mugwarin. This was just a team I threw together to try and get as many OP players in at once. We've got Benteke, Muriel. Uh, this, is a, this is when I preferred uh, Muriel to Ibarbo, although that has changed recently. Ibarbo is currently a god for me. I've only just realised that, which is kind of sad because the game's been out for almost a year now. Guarin, god. De Bruyne, god. Benteke, god. In fact, I'm going to swap him out and put in the inform Benteke because, hell. Why not? Inform Benteke. Things just got a little nicer. And of course we've got Neuer in goal. Any team with Neuer in goal is insane. Berbatang, Alaba, which is lovely. Pogba, God. Fellaini, not so much. But whatever, we'll live with it. In fact, why don't we just replace, I don't know, let's just swap him out. And put in, oh my goodness, we're just changing things up. Let's just put in Dembele. Just throw in Dembele. Look, there we go. Done. It is done. Same, same chemistry. Just as good. I, I'm, I'm the, the back across goals, but these two 
Wow, I'm going to start using these squads more, clearly. Let me move on to the midfield trio. This is the team that wasn't possible before. Um, it might have been, but it probably wasn't very good. Um, this this is only made possible because of the hyperlink. Again, thank you, Sydney Sam, for moving to Schalke. Only made possible by this hyperlink. Because now Drax is fine there. We can, we've can we got De Bruyne, we've got Pogba, and we've got Drax. Whoa, 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 Benteke. Oh, and Chelsea Remy, by the way. He looks pretty nice. We're going to swap him out, and we're going to put in the inform Benteke. Oh, my goodness. I've got Benteke in so many teams. Jeez. All right. So, yeah, that's that squad. Everything's looking good. And then I think that is it. We've used, yeah, we've seen that one. And, yeah, we will end with the B. So, that... That was a tour of my entire club. I'm um, sorry there were holes in the subs bench on some of them. I've been selling quite a few players to afford this deadly duo. And some of these guys are actually expensive. You would not believe how much it costs to get Heskey and Akin Fenwa. They're about 15k each, alright? But that was totally worth it. Martins was 20k. Antonio was 5. SYN was 10. Those beasts are expensive, but totally worth it. So yeah, this is the official Brit. Thank you for watching. This is my last FIFA squad builders. Uh, for FIFA 14. So yeah, thank you for watching all my FIFA 14 videos. And yeah, like I said, um, pending new laptop. So I'm going to try and get those other FIFA footage games. This is the last squad builder. I'll still be getting those FIFA games up as soon as I can. Um, but don't expect them in the, you know, soon. I'm going to do my best to get them on this laptop. But if not, we'll get them on the next one. Just in time for FIFA 15 to come out, at which point, like I said before, we'll be doing web app trading. So yeah, this is the official Brit. Thank you for watching. Thank you for taking a look at these absolute beasts. And yeah, goodbye. The beat go hard, though. Subscribe.